BBC Sport then, the Challenge Cup second round, a place in the third round up for grabs and the semi-finals of the 1895 Cup as well. And Martin Ridyard, no surprises that the experienced veteran, 34 years old, will get us underway here. BBC RL to get involved through social media and on Twitter as Swinton get us underway and Oldham will come off the back fence. Oh, no, they won't because uh, that one's gone out on the full. Trying to get Swinton on the front foot here and you can see how blustery it is. Hansen, nice little gap there for Rodri Lloyd and Lloyd puts the hammer down. He's got support outside him from Grant and Lepore. He won't need it. Grant's there with Scoot to the line, a break from deep. Swinton strike first, four minutes on the clock. Swinton for Oldham nil and the break from Rodri Lloyd set the tone. What a great start. <laughs> I think they just definitely uh, executed really well. They dragged the defence over to one side. They saw where the gaps were. He hit that line at beautiful pace, took the ball on and away he was. I don't think there was much stopping him really. That is perfect timing when it comes to the communication of the ball handlers, knowing where to be, knowing your role and that's what you get. Support was there, just not in the right place at this time. Better field position though as Dupre ramps up. That's a really big carry. Oldham inside the 10. Owen Cut out ball to Langtree. They've got to be in here. Surely as Langtree spilled that as he dived for the line. But Tom Grant has awarded the try. And Danny Langtree, having scored a peach in the last round against Barrow, gets another one here. And Oldham are on the board. Swinton six, Oldham four. Rodri Lloyd, who's entered the fray. There is the hooter. And uh, there we go. That is the end of the first half here. Swinton leading six points to four and Danica Prim, England and Leeds Rhinos prop. Uh, we've had a really good cup tie. Just, I mean, there's, there's not been an awful lot of niggle. There's been enough ferocity, enough intensity, but it's been played in the right spirit. A, a really good first 40 minutes. The yeah. uh, game has been a really, really good cup tie so far. Just what you want. Nip and tuck, really close for loads of ferocity and intensity and energy and, and some good play, but... Defenders, uh, attacks having to work hard to score points. Yeah, absolutely. We're going pound for pound here in uh, in the physicality of the game. And it's just that completion rate that's, uh, that's stopping the teams from being further apart from each other. Some um, absolutely monumental minutes at the moment. He hasn't had a break yet. He's down on his haunches. Meanwhile, in back play, Will Hope has split the line. Will Hope will go to the line and Will Hope will score and Swinton extend the lead. Well, he just strode through a gap that opened up Smart play from the home side and they are 10 points to four in front now and it's Will Hope who collects the points. We've got that outback option every single time for Oldham there. Owen goes flat to Spencer. Wrap around play. Dupre is through. That is sublimely worked by Oldham. Tyler Dupre just kisses the air as if to say that was sensational. And Oldham strike again. 12 points to eight. Oh, I've got to say, I'm glad to see the young lad on the board. He's, you know, he's come on the field, seen the gap. He's, he's hit the line running and gone through and got the points on the board. So maybe I'm a little bit biased because he's uh, an oddly dry nose boy, but uh, happy to see him get over the board. Applying plenty of squeeze here. There's Richard. It's opened up for Richard. Oh, he's even held up over the line. I think he got that down. Tom Grant looks to his touch judges and awards a try. Well, it just seemed to open up in front of Martin Richard. And he said, thanks very much. 16 points to 10. Swinton pushed back out again. Dare I say this is what you want, want to see in a rugby league game? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Am I allowed to say that? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> well, I've Jack said it Hansen. now. And yeah, we oh, love it. Delayed pass on to Meadows. And Meadows is through. And that was beautifully timed from Hansen. Glorious work. Double pump. Took him through the gap. Meadows was up in support. And Swinton really striking now. Big stamp of authority on this game, perhaps. The try from Meadows. Created by Hansen. Swinton have a 12-point lead. On the line, if not just over it. On the line, it is deemed by Tom Grant. Nash comes away to Richard, who will drop the goal. And it just stretches it out to a three-score lead. And that might just be the moment where Swinton booked their spot in the third round. This is the last bent, foiled 10 metres away. Owen goes into Charnock's hands. Charnock out the back onto Abram. Here goes Ben Heaton. Ben Heaton for the line. And that's a timely try that might just hand Oldham a route back into this game. Time is against them, but Ben Heaton has given Oldham 
a sliver of a lifeline, and it's 23 points to 14. That is the that can't come at a better time. That's going to give Oldham a little bit of a boost of confidence. You know they're going to give him, take a moment now just to regroup and regather. So Martin Ridgard slugs it to touch, and that is the end of the cup tie. What a furious pace, ferociously fought, and high quality Challenge Cup second round tie. This has been Swinton 23, Oldham 14. So much for both sides to take credit from. But it's the Lions who are looking for their first trip to Wembley in their history who progress to the next round and a possible Super League tie in the next phase of the competition.